Have you ever felt a connection so profound that it feels like you've known the person for ages, even in the first meeting? This is no ordinary connection. We're talking about twin flames here, a concept that transcends the physical realm and delves into the spiritual. Twin flames are believed to be two halves of the same soul, split and sent on separate journeys only to meet again when both halves have grown and learnt their lessons. It's an intense connection, more potent than that of soulmates. And contrary to popular belief, it's not always a romantic one. This bond can manifest as a deep, unshakable friendship that stands the test of time. But here's the twist. The universe has a quirky sense of humor. You found this extraordinary connection, this person who feels like home, but they're married to someone else. Yet what happens when you discover your twin flame, but they're married to someone else? Let's delve deeper into understanding twin flames. Imagine a single soul, a spark of divine energy, split into two halves. These halves are then sent on separate paths of existence to grow and evolve, gathering unique experiences. These two halves are what we refer to as twin flames. They are mirror souls, reflecting each other's strengths and weaknesses, embodying the yin and yang of the same essence. Spiritual experts often describe the twin flame connection as the most intense and spiritual connection one can experience. It's not just about romantic love, it's about growth, it's about transformation. Two souls, separated at birth, journeying through life to eventually reunite and complete a cycle of spiritual growth. It's a beautiful yet complex phenomenon. Now you might be wondering, if twin flames are two halves of the same soul, why don't they just find each other and live happily ever after? Well, that's where the journey of twin flames becomes intricate. The purpose of this journey isn't just to find each other, but to grow spiritually. Each half must experience life separately, overcoming challenges, learning lessons, and evolving spiritually. This journey shapes them, prepares them for the eventual reunion. It's like two pieces of a jigsaw puzzle, each going through a process of refinement and transformation until they fit perfectly together. And when they do reunite, it's not just a meeting of two bodies, but a fusion of two souls that have become whole again, achieving a higher state of consciousness and spiritual growth. But this journey is not always smooth, especially when external factors like marriage come into play. It's a question that plagues many. Why is my twin flame married to someone else? This question can cause a whirlwind of emotions, but let's try to understand it from a broader perspective. Firstly, it's crucial to understand that twin flame relationships are not always romantic. They are profound soul connections, and sometimes these connections are meant to teach us lessons rather than culminate in a romantic union. If your twin flame is married to someone else, it could be because you or they are meant to learn certain lessons from this situation. Relationship experts often talk about how every relationship, no matter how brief or long, teaches us something valuable about ourselves and our journey in this life. Secondly, the concept of karma plays a significant role in twin flame relationships. It's believed that twin flames often have karma to resolve from past lives. If your twin flame is married to someone else, it could be a karmic situation that needs to be worked out. This could be challenging, but it's all part of the spiritual journey that twin flames embark on together. Then there's the aspect of individual growth. Sometimes, we are not ready to unite with our twin flame. We may need to grow individually, to become the best version of ourselves before we can truly connect with our twin flame. In these cases, the twin flame may be married to someone else as part of their own growth process. But let's also not forget the complexities of love and relationships. Love is multifaceted and sometimes, it doesn't follow the path we expect. Your twin flame being married to someone else could be a part of their journey. And while it may be painful, it's essential to remember that every journey has its own time and pace. It's important to remember, though, that every twin flame journey is unique. What holds true for one may not for another. So keep faith, learn from these experiences, and trust that your journey is unfolding as it should. Facing the reality of your twin flame being married can be challenging. Indeed, the emotional roller coaster that ensues can be overwhelming. It's not uncommon to feel a sense of loss, confusion, and even anger. 
you might find yourself questioning the very essence of the twin flame concept or even doubting your own feelings. But let's take a moment and breathe. It's important to remember that our emotions are valid and they are a part of our human experience. However, it's also essential to not let them control us. Instead, we should aim to understand them, to navigate through them and ultimately to grow from them. So how do we deal with such intense feelings? The key lies in self-love and growth. Self-love is not about being selfish or egocentric. It's about acknowledging our worth, our needs and our desires. It's about setting healthy boundaries and respecting ourselves. When we truly love ourselves, we are able to face any challenge head on with grace and strength. Furthermore, self-growth is about constantly evolving, learning and improving. It's about turning our experiences into lessons, our pain into strength. As we grow, we become more resilient, more understanding and more compassionate. We start seeing our situation from a different perspective, a perspective of growth and understanding rather than despair and confusion. When dealing with the reality of your twin flame being married, it's important to remember that everyone is on their own journey. It's not about them choosing someone else over you, but about them choosing what they need for their own growth at this point in their life. And that's okay. It doesn't diminish the connection you share, nor does it invalidate your feelings. In fact, it's an opportunity for you to focus on your own journey, your own growth. It's an invitation to dive deeper into your self-love practice, to explore your passions, to heal your wounds, to become the best version of yourself. It's a chance to grow, not despite the situation, but because of it. Remember, the twin flame journey is as much about your own spiritual growth as it is about the connection. A question often asked is, can twin flames end up together? In the fascinating realm of twin flames, this query stirs up a whirlwind of emotions and thoughts. It's a profound journey that transcends the physical plane, and the answer to this question can be just as complex. Yes, twin flames can end up together. In fact, this union is the ultimate goal of the twin flame journey. It's a harmonious union of two souls, a spiritual homecoming. However, this doesn't always mean a romantic partnership or a marriage. It could manifest as a deep, abiding friendship, a creative partnership, or simply a spiritual connection that remains, regardless of physical proximity. The circumstances under which twin flames unite are as varied as the individuals involved. Some might find their way to each other after years of personal growth and healing. Others may have to overcome significant obstacles like societal norms, personal fears, or even geographical distances. It's a journey that requires patience, resilience, and a whole lot of self-love. But it's equally important to understand that not all twin flames end up together in the conventional sense, and that's okay. The twin flame journey is not a fairy tale where everyone gets a picture-perfect ending. It's a spiritual journey that's about personal growth, self-discovery, and unconditional love. Sometimes the best thing twin flames can do for each other is to let go, allowing each other the freedom to grow independently. Even if twin flames don't end up together, the connection remains. It's a bond that transcends time and space. It's a profound love that doesn't require physical proximity to exist. Whether they're continents apart or in the same room, twin flames are always connected at a soul level. It's crucial to remember that the twin flame journey is not about the destination. It's about the journey itself, the lessons learned, the growth experienced, and the love shared. It's about becoming the best version of yourself and finding peace within. The twin flame journey is not about the destination, but the journey itself. Despite the challenges, it's crucial to stay positive. In navigating the labyrinth of emotions that the twin flame journey entails, Maintaining a positive mindset is like the North Star guiding your way. It's not just about wishful thinking or blind optimism. Rather, it's about embracing an attitude that encourages growth, healing, and transformation. Now, why is positivity so important? Well, spiritual experts often describe it as a magnet that pulls towards you the experiences you desire. It shapes your reality, influences your decisions, and ultimately determines the direction of your journey. But let's be clear, staying positive doesn't mean ignoring or suppressing your feelings. It's about acknowledging them, understanding them, and then choosing to focus on what uplifts you. 
It's about recognizing the silver lining in every situation. Your twin flame might be married to someone else, but perhaps this is an opportunity for you to evolve and grow as an individual. Remember, every situation we encounter is a stepping stone towards personal growth. Your twin flame journey is no different. It's an opportunity to delve deeper into your own spirituality, to understand your true essence and to grow in love and wisdom. It's also about cultivating faith and trust. Trust in the universe, trust in the journey, and most importantly, trust in yourself. Have faith that everything is unfolding as it should, even if it doesn't seem like it at the moment. Moreover, positivity is contagious. It can influence those around you, including your twin flame. Your positivity might be the beacon that guides them back to you, or it may simply inspire them to embark on their own journey of growth and self-discovery. So, in this twin flame journey, let positivity be your guide. Let it light up the path, let it fuel your steps, and let it transform your experiences. After all, the twin flame journey is a spiritual one and positivity is key. So, you've discovered your twin flame, but they're married to someone else. It's a tough spot to be in, but remember, this journey is unique to you. We've traversed quite a path today, touching on the complex world of twin flames, understanding the essence of this spiritual bond, and exploring why sometimes our twin flame might be married to someone else. We've unpacked the reality of this situation, acknowledging the pain, the confusion, but also the room for growth it presents. Remember? We've talked about how the twin flame journey isn't always about romantic union. It's more about the personal and spiritual growth that comes from such an intense connection. It's about learning, evolving, and finding your true self. We've also discussed the possibility of twin flames ending up together. It's not impossible, but it's not the end goal either. The journey of twin flames is not a straightforward romantic saga. It's a spiritual odyssey it's about finding a mirror in another soul, a reflection that helps you understand yourself better, that pushes you to grow and evolve. Remember how we emphasized staying positive? This journey might be riddled with obstacles, but it's important to keep your spirits high. It's about understanding that the universe has a plan for you. It's about learning to trust the process even when it seems unfathomable. So as we wind up, let's remind ourselves of the core message. The twin flame journey is not about reaching a romantic destination. It's about self-discovery, learning, growing, and evolving. It's about understanding that sometimes the most intense love can exist without a traditional relationship framework. It's about accepting that your twin flame's marriage to someone else doesn't diminish your connection, but rather it's a part of your unique journey. The twin flame journey is a challenging yet rewarding path. Embrace the journey, focus on your growth, and remember, everything happens for a reason.